welcome back first timers. But if you're new here, I'm David and this is Terry. We're the first timers. We're trying things for the first time and you can too. In today's episode, we're checking out some of the shopping spots around Destin. And we're starting with Baytown Wharf. Tell me a little bit more about Baytown Wharf. It is located in the San Destin Gulf and Beach Resort. Right on the shores of the Choctawatchee Bay. Try, try to say that three <laughs> times fast. Uh, they have shops, eateries, art galleries. Uh, you can actually uh, get a timeshare out here or stay in one of their condos. They have events all year long. And today they got a farmer's market. It's from 10 to two on Saturdays. Let's check it out. We'll give you a walking tour. But first, I need to get some coffee. You know it. We stopped at Charlie's Donut Truck for a quick coffee, but they had something I've never seen before. And it's a cream filled bear claw. Give it a sample and we're gonna get to walking. Thoughts? After two bites, I haven't got to the cream yet. <laughs> Let me keep going. Oh, mm. It's cream filled from the behind. <laughs> That's it should be. And it's not cream, actually. Is it custard? No, it's filled with apple filling. If you start on the toes of the bear, <laughs> you're not going to hit the cream until you get to the behind. So start from the back. <laughs> so like Terry said, there's a lot of shops. There's a farmer's market today. Bunch of restaurants and bars. And there's one area that's kind of like a restaurant row. It's There's a pizza shop. There's a, a robot cafe where robots deliver food to you. It's pretty interesting. <laughs> there's a candy shop, barbecue, seafood. There's a place called The Village Door. It's very popular out here. We've eaten here before. We're not going to eat here today, but it was really, really good. And it's right on the water. But we're, we hear they're known for their late night parties. Yeah. It's kind of the hot spot around here for dancing. We've never been there. Maybe one time Maybe if, we'll we, check it out. if we dust off our uh, old dancing shoes, we'll <laughs> check it out. But a lot of places to eat. There's new places popping up. Margaritaville is coming, Landshark. There are docks right at the end of here. But come down. If you've eaten at any of these places, comment below. Let us know which ones we need to try because there's so many yeah. that I, we're not going to be able to. We're not, we're not doing a food tour here Today's today. <laughs> Today's not that day. We're, we're trying to get to the beach. Yeah. Besides the shops, the bars, the restaurants, this place really shines in what it offers families and for kids. Yeah. They have a big playground. They have a carousel. They've got a rock climbing wall, zip lining, uh, something called Stairway to Heaven. I think you just climb a bunch of stairs. <laughs> uh, trampoline, a ropes course. Escape room. Escape room, an arcade. I think there's even golfing. This is a great place to bring the kids and the family, let them run around. There's also a huge park that's just free and open. So you could just bring the kids. There's like a rope climbing area. Yeah. You can also fish in their lagoon, but it's catch and release only. Watch out for alligators. <laughs> We're going to wrap up here and on to the next spot. We're down at the Destin Commons and we were going to grab some lunch down here, but they got a car show going on. It's a charity event and it's called Burning Up the Beaches. Let's take a look and see if there's anything we feel like test driving. <laughs> I don't think that's an option though.
Destin Commons is a huge outdoor mall. It's kind of like the place in Las Vegas, if anybody's familiar with that. Town Square. Town Square. There's a lot of name brand stores, but then there's also small boutique shops, restaurants, bars, entertainment. Bowling. There's a movie theater and uh, Uncle Buck's Fishbowl. <laughs> Fishbowl. It's a fish themed bowling area, fish themed yeah. bowling place. But it's also home to the Destin Food Hall, which you guys saw us try food at every one of the establishments that was open at that time. We'll link that right here. I think a couple new restaurants have popped up, so we're gonna go check those out now. We don't want you guys to miss out on any of the options. <laughs> well, we got here a little too early, so the restaurants that we thought were new and opened aren't. So we're gonna just try different things here from the places we've already eaten. Yeah. And we didn't actually have any drinks when we were here, and they have this giant bar right in the middle, so Terry decided to try something a little special. Boy Thai Martini. So Thai tea martini. Yeah, all, right. all right, give it a whirl. Here we go. Try not to spill. Oh, wow. If you like espresso martinis, you, you would like that. I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> I love Thai tea. It just needs like one or two boba floating in it. Or boba on a toothpick. Yeah, there you That's go. my recommendation. Well, we have to come back to one of our favorites here at Destin Food Hall at PB&J, where they make some of the most unique and just banging sandwiches. And but, pastries and, and salads. And, and, and don't forget about Aunt Millie's oh, almond tea. tea. But we're gonna try some other food, so we didn't want to get a sandwich this time. We decided to try the tandem bike smoked tomato bisque. bisque. Let's give this a try. Ooh, that bread is fluffy. Crispy, dunkable. Oh no. No, that's fresh. It's clean. Tastes super homemade. That bread is phenomenal. The bread just adds a whole nother level of crispy and buttery. Start every meal with that. <laughs> I think I'm gonna convince Terry to try oxtail today. And I, when I say I think, Terry is trying oxtail today. There, you go first. So it's oxtail piled on rice. There's some pickled vegetables, fried plantain on the side. All right, here we go. First timer. Tad bit spicy. That Jamaican flavor is off the charts. The seasoning is great. I mean, you get that clove, that cinnamon, the nutmeg, yeah. all the spices, the allspice. <laughs> so good and oh there's some heat uh -huh. oh that's a good heat though this is really good oxtail super tender falling apart you got the carrots the beans you got all the flavor oh and the heat is still going yeah it's really good oh and the beat goes on the rice is good oh but it it does mm. it does have some heat to it that is good creamy buttery spicy I regret not getting this the first time. Yeah. Definitely get this. You might remember how much we love the brisket taco for Macho Taco. Well, we loved it so much that we wanted to pay the upcharge and turn it into a giant burrito. It's pretty giant. And this cup of avocado, holy crap. Yeah. We're gonna cut this thing open. We already know we're gonna like it. So, I mean, there's no, there's no there's surprise no here. Reveal. It's just gonna be delicious. That burrito's bigger than my head. <laughs> burrito cheers. Exactly what we were thinking. A bigger, ricier, beanier, vegetable-ier version of the taco. If you're hungry, you want to get filled up, eat this. Definitely. That's really good. Compliments to the chef. Definitely would recommend. We keep coming back to this place because the options are endless. Yeah. The flavors are incredible, the people are great. If you get a chance, check out Destin City Food Hall. Go out, take a look at Baytown Wharf. Come out to Destin Commons. It'll scratch all your shopping needs, <laughs> food, entertainment, drinking, 
whatever you need, I'm sure you'll find it at one of these places. But find us on Instagram, follow us, because we'll put sneak peeks on things that we're doing and videos that are coming out in the near future. Also, don't forget to like and comment and also subscribe to our channel. We would really appreciate the support. We love making these videos. Let us know that you want us to make these videos by uh, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Till next time. First timers. High five. <laughs>